noon, a former 16 year old high school student faced a judge this morning. He is accused of posting video on social media which shows someone pulling out a gun and pointing it at students in a classroom. CBS 4's Carrie Cott is live outside the courthouse in Fort Lauderdale with those details. Carrie? Good afternoon, Maribel. The judge in this case said the teenager accused here will be in juvenile detention for at least 21 days. He also will undergo a threat assessment and a psychological evaluation. Wilmer Guerrero Martinez. The teen accused of making a threat on social media and posting this disturbing video of a person pulling out a gun and pointing it at the back of unsuspecting students in a classroom sat in a Broward County courtroom Thursday. Judge Michael Orlando said the team will be interviewed by a mental health professional to try and get some answers about his alleged behavior. What sort of issues uh, he may be dealing with or struggling with, or what would cause him uh, to engage in this sort of behavior? The teen's parents attended the hearing. Anything that you, you want to say with your son? Afterwards, as they left court, they declined to speak with us. Hollywood police say it's unclear when this video was taken. Detectives say Wilmer Martinez posted the video to social media on Tuesday, along with a post that read in part, I'm debating on whether I should carry my pistol with me like last year. Concerned people saw the post and called police. Detectives investigated and arrested Martinez late Wednesday. Hollywood police says Martinez was expelled from MacArthur High School last year after another incident. This student was expelled from MacArthur High School for bringing ammunition into the school. So he was already expelled, uh, and detectives think at this point maybe this video was filmed you know, last year, but it was just posted to social media yesterday. Police say if there's one important reminder to this case, it's that if you see something threatening, you need to say something to law enforcement. Multiple people called police to report it, and that's what's important here is that um, this community had the courage to come forward to police um, and help officers um, stop something potentially dangerous from occurring in our schools. Now, this case has brought up some important questions that we're trying to get answered, like what happened after this student was found with ammunition at his high school? Was there follow-up from schools police or Hollywood police? Also, was there anything else in this student's disciplinary background? The school district told me this morning that the disciplinary records for students are private, so we cannot see them. Now, one final note, Hollywood police is asking that anyone that has information about this video call Hollywood police detectives. Live in Fort Lauderdale, Kerry Codd, CBS 4 News.